It's the 44th regular meeting of the National Council on Agriculture and Rural Development in Abuja, and government officials as well as agricultural entrepreneurs from the private sector are here to brainstorm on how to address the rising threats to food security occasioned by insecurity, COVID-19 pandemic and climate change. As a responsibility of this meeting, we will effectively examine the challenges in the agricultural sector and explore best approach to sustaining food security, employment generation, and wealth creation in the country. Recent forecast by the United Nations says there will be an acute food shortage in over 20 countries, including Nigeria. The report also says that 16 northern states and the federal capital territory would face food and nutrition crisis. Participants at this meeting believe strongly that investing in agriculture research and rural infrastructure development is a solution to the looming crisis. Government should step up the implementation of policies for closing the infrastructure gap in many ways. The nexus of rural infrastructure is very key in the form of serving as a backbone to agriculture for the attainment of national food security. Research is sine qua non to agricultural growth. The establishment of a National Research and Development Foundation for Nigeria, currently being driven by Ted Fund's Research and Development Standing Committee, becomes imperative. Apart from the rising insecurity, which has limited interstate trading on food items, clashes between farmers and pastoralists is another major challenge to food security, which some say needs to be addressed urgently through a repeal of the Land Use Act. If we are to develop a cultural program, we need to do a critical and surgical operation on our Land Use Act. This is to ensure that farmers are able, number one, to use the land to assess fund. The price of food items in Nigeria is on the rise, and according to the United Nations, the situation will remain so for a while if nothing is done to address the root causes.